talking about this new cosmology. This is Doctorus Newtopia, and we are at Kitt Peak discussing cosmology and the reproduction of the planet. I realize that Gaia, this planetary living organism that, that is responsible for our climate, is on the verge of reproduction. With our technologies, we can go and travel into outer space. We can become extraterrestrials. And we have become extraterrestrials. We're bu building an international space station so we're on the verge of this realization that we are the human species, that we flag, fly one flag, the Earth flag, and that there is this great birth going on of this universal humanity. And it is so thrilling to be part of this, to be born at this time of this great birth. We start seeing that it wasn't a big bang that brought us into existence, but a big birth. And so this is why it's such a, a feminine time to be alive, to, to understand the sacred feminine within, because we all have to birth this together. And when we do, we are going to connect with other extraterrestrials, with the technology to be able to have solar cells, that travel throughout the galaxies. And who knows, the possibilities are wonderful. And it's so exciting to think of the children of this world being able to become uh, space people and live on spaceships. And we have to see all of Earth as a spaceship. This is our planet, and we have to manage it in a way that steers it on a direction for peace because peace is a, is a prerequisite to getting off this planet. And so this is why our colleges are so important because they are actually containers that we need to live in inhospitable environments such as outer space or underwater or in deserts that have little water. And that's why it is so critical that we here in the desert of Arizona realize the importance of living in our arcology when, where all of our waste is recycled and we are living within the means that we have as far, as far as water limits. So think of ourselves as living in a spaceship and you can start understanding what arcology is and why this is a birth into a new architectural foundation. Thank you.